So today we're going to talk a little bit about flams. Flams are really just one way to make one note sound fat and big. How we do a flam is we first get in our match strip, right? And flams really help you with the concept of stick heights. So one hand is going to be higher, while the other hand is going to be lower. We call this higher hand, like in a rebound stroke mode, we call this higher hand the primary stroke. This lower hand is going to be quieter because it's going to take less time for the stick to get from this height to the drum. We call that a grace note. So the function here is the primary note is the primary note. It's going to play, okay, but the grace note, this is called a grace note, is going to play right before it, and it's going to be quiet, and it's going to introduce that note. So what you end up with is this guy and then the primary note. So slow motion, you end up with something about like that. You always want your grace note to come before your primary note when you're playing a flam. So I'll try to play it slow. So if you're playing what's called a right flam, that means your right hand is going to be higher, your left hand is going to be lower. If you're playing a left flam, the process is reversed. The left hand is high and it's the primary note. The right hand is low and it's the grace note. So the right hand plays and then the left. Now how you actually play a flam, it's very important to prepare the flam. You'll see students who try to play flams and they'll go. Well, the problem was they didn't prepare the flam first. Preparing a flam literally means you make one hand higher and this is part of the flam. So step one, step two, step one, step two. So when you practice what's called alternating flams, you want to make sure that you're literally preparing the stroke and then playing it. So although I'm not making any sound at this point, this is still part half of the flam. So alternating flams is when you play the right flam, so left hand first, then a left flam where the right grace note comes first, and you do that back and forth. This is called alternating flams. So that was alternating flams. Here's what's called flam taps. Flam taps are basically nothing more but double strokes with a grace note. Let me explain. So your right hand's gonna come up for a right flam. Your left hand grace note's gonna be down here. You're gonna go that left right again. That's your right flam and then another right. So for flam taps, you're gonna get a flam and what they call a tap, but it's really not really a tap, but we'll call it that. Flam stroke is what it should be called. Flam stroke. And so you reverse the process, left hand higher, right hand lower, play the flam, and then a left. So flam taps are really nothing more than just double strokes, right, right, left, left, with a grace note before each one, right? guys and that actually concludes the basics um, snare video so appreciate it